हेलो एवरी वन आई एम दत्तात्रय निकम वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन अवर चैनल ई फंडा न्यू डे न्यू टॉपिक एंड अवर टूडेज टॉपिक इज इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन कंट्रोल पैनल पार्ट फोर्टीन ए एंड इफ यू आर न्यू टू अवर चैनल देन प्लीज विजिट टू अवर चैनल ई फंडा एंड वॉच ऑल द वीडियोज क्रिएटेड रिलेटेड टू द टॉपिक ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग प्रोजेक्ट एंड इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन एंड कंट्रोल इंजीनियरिंग एंड Don't forget to subscribe to our channel eFunda to get latest updates and review on various subject also upload of our new video on our channel eFunda so let's begin with our today's topic that is instrumentation control panel part 14a in instrumentation control panel and control room engineering series we have already created the video instrumentation and control basic part a for each you can find the link in our i button also in our today's video we are covering instrumentation control panels part 14a and in future video will be control room engineering part 14b instrumentation control panels that is control center what is instrument control panel instrumentation control panels are designed to monitor and control level such as a temperature flow current and a pressure from the field instrument that are connected to it control panel is used to accommodate instruments for the purpose of measurement monitoring protection detection control and manage the processes the panels are located in the control room as well as a field term as a local control panel that is lcp for operational convenience and we can see some of the panel photographs we have used for a ready reference continuous to instrumentation control panel this is a combination of the services protective enclosure and environmental treatment necessary for the proper functioning of the control center now we will see the various types of control panel first basic classification that is a type of panel first open end panel preferred only in a controlled and a dust free environment one can see the figure where one can see the open end panel second enclosed panel preferred to give a better protection prevent unauthorized access to panel components and are aesthetically designed one can see in a second photograph that enclosed panel where all the components or equipment assemblies are assembled inside the panel and it is a enclosed by the door where all the monitoring or push buttons are indicated on the same second style of panel first flat face panel most economical design wherein all the panels instruments are mounted in a vertical plane the straight and vertical plane of the panel allows an orderly layout of a tubing electrical ductwork and miscellaneous equipment one can see first figure where flat control panel is shown it's a vertical design where one can see the various types of annunciator windows for the indications and controller status is shown on the elevation drawing second point break front panel increase the surface area available for mounting the instruments without increasing overall height for example console type and a desktop type where front is broken into vertical section and horizontal section for mounting the panel instrument one can see in a second sketch breakthrough panel elevation drawing where it has been modified to have the console type desk with allowable annunciators or a semi graphic type windows as well as the keyboard and interface with a interfacing devices this is how the style of the panel is covered mounting of panel first floor mounting when the number of instruments on the panel is high requiring a vertical height of 2 meter example marshaling or system cabinet one can see first photograph where the vertical height of 2 meter panel is shown where 
it is uh, rested or uh, mounted on a floor so as to have a standing panel to cover a required number of instruments which requires high space it's covered and shown in the photograph second wall mounting when the panel instruments can be accommodated in a panel of a smaller dimensions that is analysis or a analyzer small packages one can see the second photograph it's a wall mounted to have small instrument or less instrument which require less space this is all about the mounting of the panel fourth protection of panel first one pressurized porch panel when the panel is located in an electrically hazardous area and location cannot be shifted to safe area due to operational requirement where the external atmosphere is corrosive that is from field that is local to control room that is remote one can see first photograph is the, about the purge panel where it is enclosed panel and one can see how the other related accessories or instruments are mounted and this is located in the hazardous area second non pressurized panel standard construction and use where the panel location is in a safe area and non corrosive atmosphere one can see the second photograph where normal panels are used to have installation of various instruments or indicating devices this is how the protection of panel is covered control center specification as per isa rp 60.4 latest edition first point approval by the participating organization that is client second approval by the authorities by inspection that is inspection agency third code compliance fourth point quality assurance quality control and basic cost estimation fifth point purchase contract and supporting document testing and calibration manufacturing test record and performance guarantee sixth system documentation system configuration detail that is a microprocessor display type programmable controller program documentation etc seven instrument and equipment list tagged item items from pnids are as per isa s5.1 instrumentation symbols and identification unique identification proper tag definition etc example fy 100 ab instrumentation tagging indicating controllers recorder converters etc b untagged item instrument shelves instrument racks terminal blocks relay clocks programmable controller multiplexers input output racks that is io card is covered under untagged item fabricated item control center sections upper lower etc consoles auxiliary relay and equipment rack this is about the control center specification we will see few more points eight number graphics isa s 5.5 symbols used for dynamic displays operator and interface devices nine identification isa rp 60.6 name plates labels and tags for control centers 10 point constructions considering seismic or any type of vibration that is a vibration proof this is all about the control center specification are considered while designing the control center one can see the photograph where the latest standards is being applied and construction of the control center panel is done and one can see how systematically and aesthetically this panel is looking this is how one should cover the control center with minimum requirement as per isa rp 60.4 and client specification moving on to type of instrumentation panel that is a control panels and cabinet generally instrumentation panel standard sizes are considered by industry are as follows and same can be changed based on the specific project requirement first is 1200 mm by 1200 by 2100 height or 1200 by 
एट हंड्रेड बाय ट्वेंटी वन हंड्रेड हाइट सेकेंड टाइप एट हंड्रेड बाय एट हंड्रेड बाय ट्वेंटी वन एम एम हाइट दिस इज हाउ दी स्टैंडर्ड साइजेस आर कंसिडर द सेम कैन बी चेंज बेस्ड ऑन दी प्रोजेक्ट रिक्वायरमेंट सेकेंडली दी टाइप ऑफ इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन कैबिनेट्स आर मार्शलिंग कैबिनेट्स सिस्टम कैबिनेट्स सिस्टम कम मार्शलिंग कैबिनेट इलेक्ट्रॉनिक मार्शलिंग कैबिनेट्स वन कैन सी द फोटोग्राफ वेर वन कैन सी दी कंट्रोल पैनल एंड हाइट ऑफ द कंट्रोल पैनल वेर द सिस्टमेटिक अरेंजमेंट ऑफ अ कॉम्पोनेंट्स आर शोन वी विल सी फ्रॉम टॉप टू बॉटम अलार्म पैनल सेकेंड इज अ पावर डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन यूनिट दैट इज अ पी डी यू थर्ड वन इज नाइनटीन इंच रैक कैबिनेट शेल्फ वन कंट्रोल शेल्फ दैट इज अ मैंडेटरी शेल्फ टू एक्सपांशन शेल्फ ऑप्शनल शेल्फ थ्री एक्सपांशन शेल्फ ऑप्शनल फोर्थ शेल्फ एक्सपांशन शेल्फ ऑप्शनल दिस इज हाउ दी फ्रंट एंड रेयर ऑफ दिस कैबिनेट्स आर इक्विप विथ स्क्रीन डोर दैट कैन बी लॉक्ड यूजिंग द सेम की दिस इज ऑल अबाउट दी टिपिकल कंट्रोल पैनल नाउ वी विल सी वन बाय वन ईच टाइप ऑफ कैबिनेट मूविंग ऑन टू अंडरस्टैंडिंग द इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन कैबिनेट बैक टू बेसिक प्लीज रेफर अवर प्रीवियस वीडियो सो एज टू अंडरस्टैंड द सिग्नल फ्रो फ्रॉम फील्ड टू कंट्रोल रूम नाउ वी विल सी फील्ड इंस्ट्रूमेंट इज कनेक्टेड टू द जंक्शन बॉक्सेस एंड फ्रॉम जंक्शन बॉक्सेस इट विल कनेक्ट टू द मार्शलिंग कैबिनेट एंड फ्रॉम मार्शलिंग कैबिनेट सिग्नल विल कनेक्ट टू द सिस्टम कैबिनेट and from the prefabricated cable or a data cable it will be connected to the operator console to have a complete indication monitoring and control similarly one can see the typical loop diagram where the field and a control room parts on shown will start from the field area pressure transmitter is connected with a branch cable it will connected to the junction boxes and from the junction boxes multi pair cable will be connected to the marshalling boxes where the terminal board this marshalling multi pair cable is connected then the cross wiring that is the internal wiring between the tb and isolator barrier it will be connected inside the marshalling cabinet and from marshalling cabinet the system cabinets will be connected through the prefabricated cable so as to get the signal on a io cord to have a indication monitoring and control by the operator this will help you to understand the signal flow from field to the operator console and this will help you to understand our future slides as well moving on to marshalling cabinet the marshalling cabinet acts as an interface between the system cabinet and field junction boxes the main cables are laid from the field junction boxes to the marshalling cabinet the prefab cables from the system cabinets io card are also terminated in the marshalling cabinet one can see the first photograph where vertical 2 meter height panel is a floor mounted one can see how the components are arranged in a sequence so as to perform the interface from field to the system cabinet and in another photograph one can see how the terminal boards or tbs are shown and this further connection to the isolators are done this is all about the marshalling cabinet in next slide we will see some of the design consideration while considering marshalling cabinets design marshalling cabinets design consideration first one all the wires from field multi pair core cable should be terminated in a marshalling cabinet change in a cable type example 16 pair to 24 pair would have an increased terminal inside the marshalling cabinet one can see how the rows are shown where the terminal boards are shown that is a terminals on the marshalling cabinet second point change in junction box grouping will have a little impact on a cross wiring however it will have a no impact on io assignment third point parallel equipment there is two out of three voting related to io should be assigned in a different io card with the help of cross wiring fourth point the number of main cables terminated in a one cabinet should be reviewed properly 
for ease of maintenance this is applicable for all type of marshalling system cabinet fifth point io allocation and the marshalling cabinet should be based on the controller segregation philosophy this applies to all type of marshalling and system cabinets moving on to system cabinets there are various elements in the cabinet to which some of them are motherboard memory chip cables processor ports etc one can see the photograph first photograph where one can see the vertical cabinet with a 2 meter height where all the system related equipments or cards one can see now it will show a motherboard ports and interfaces expansion slots memory chips processor storage devices etc in another photograph one can see how the system cable that is prefabricated cable are connected to the controller so as to have the signal from marshalling to the system cabinet to get the signal to the operator desk for further processing this is how the system cabinet covers the requirement where various types of components are shown with this we are concluding on our today's topic and you can find our channel details as follows if you are new to our channel that is our youtube channel e funda then subscribe to our channel e funda and don't forget to press bell icon to get latest notification of upload of our new video on our channel e funda similarly you can follow us on instagram page similarly you can follow us on our facebook page as well and keep watching our channel e funda for various topic related to engineering and a project with this we can assure you this will help you to better your understanding on engineering and a project topic keep watching our channel e funda thanks watch our channel for new day new topics